Harmonic means is the terms between the first term and the end term of a harmonic sequence. Ibig sabihin yung nasa pagitan ng harmonic sequence. To insert harmonic means, take the reciprocal of the given, insert arithmetic means, and take reciprocal again. Hello mga anak shis! Welcome to Math TV PH. Ang channel na ito ay tungkol sa math tutorials, lectures, or discussions na Tagalog at Taglish na dedicated sa lahat ng mga estudyante. Kung interesado ka, please like, subscribe, at i-click mo na rin ang notification bell para ma-notify ka kapag may bago akong upload na video. Isang mapagpalang araw sa inyong lahat. This is Teacher Jinjin Tigandeza. At sa video na ito, ay ituturo ko sa inyo kung paano kumuha ng harmonic means between terms. Kung hindi nyo pa napapanood yung harmonic sequence, i-click nyo lang dito sa taas. Ilalagay ko dito sa taas. Number one example, find the three harmonic means between one-fourth and negative one-half. Remember na ang harmonic sequence ay reciprocal lang ng arithmetic sequence. So, kunin lang natin yung reciprocal ng one-fourth. which is 4. Ang reciprocal naman ng negative 1 half ay negative 2. So, ang hinahanap dito ay 3 harmonic means. So, ibig sabihin, merong 1 fourth, tatlong hinahanap, and negative 1 half. Ngayon, gawin natin arithmetic means para magamit natin yung formula ng arithmetic means. So, 4, then tatlong arithmetic means negative 2. Since hindi given ang common difference dahil wala namang magkasunod na terms, gamitin natin yung formula ng arithmetic sequence para makuha yung common difference. So, first, ang formula ng arithmetic sequence ay a sub n is equal to a sub 1 plus the quantity of n minus 1 times d. Ngayon, ang a sub n natin ay a sub 5 kasi meron tayong fifth term at meron tayong first term. So, a sub 5 is equal to a sub 1 is 4 plus n is 5 kasi nga 5 yung hinahanap minus 1 times d. Next, a sub 5 is equal to negative 2 is equal to 4 plus 5 minus 1 is equal to 4 times d is equal to 4d. Next is, ilipat natin yung positive 4 sa kabila, mag-change ng sign, magiging negative 4 is equal to 4d. Next, isimplify natin, negative 2 minus 4 is equal to negative 6 is equal to 4d. Para makuha natin yung d, i-divide natin ito ng 4. Okay, so d is equal to negative 6 over 4 is I-reduce natin, negative 3 halves. So, meron na tayong common difference na negative 3 halves. Ngayon, yung negative 3 halves, idadagdag lang natin dito sa first term. So, 4 plus negative 3 halves is equal to 5 over 2. Next, 5 over 2 plus negative 3 halves is equal to, ilagay natin dito, 1. Next naman, 1 plus negative 3 halves is equal to negative 1 half. Then, negative 1 half plus negative 3 halves, ang magiging sagot niya, negative 2. Since arithmetic means ito, kunin natin yung harmonic means. Kunin lang natin yung reciprocal ng 5 over 2, which is 2 over 5. Ang reciprocal ng 1 ay 1 pa rin. Ang reciprocal ng negative 1 half ay negative 2. So, ang tatlong harmonic means ay 2 fifth, 1, and negative 2. Another example, insert 3 harmonic means between negative 1 half and 1 over 16. So, first, palitan muna natin ito, get the reciprocal. Ang reciprocal ng negative 1 half ay negative 2. Then, mag-insert ng 3 harmonic means. So, meron tayong tatlong hinahanap. Ang hinahanap ay yung a sub 2, a sub 3, and a sub 4. Then, ang a sub 5 natin is 16. Para makuha yung common difference, gamitin natin yung formula ng arithmetic sequence. 
Okay, find the given. A sub 1 is negative 2. Ang n natin is 5. Ang a sub 5 natin is 16. So, meron tayong a sub n is equal to a sub 1 plus the quantity of n minus 1 times d. So, ang a sub n natin is a sub 5 is equal to first term is negative 2 plus n is 5 minus 1 times d. Next is a sub 5 is 16 since yun ang fifth term is equal to a sub 2 plus 5 minus 1 is equal to 4 times d is equal to 4d. Next, i-transpose natin yung negative 2 sa kabila. Mag-change siya ng sign. Magiging 16 plus 2 is equal to 4d. Next, simplify. 16 plus 2 is equal to 18 is equal to 4d. Para matanggal si 4, i-divide natin both sides ng 4. Ngayon, ang d natin is so, 18 divided by 4 is equal to 4.5 or, or 9 over 2. Pwede nyo namang gamitin yung mag plus kayo dito. Pero kung kailangan ng solution, ganito. A sub n is equal to A sub 1 plus n minus 1 times D, di ba? So, Ang hinanap is a sub 2. a sub 2 is equal to, first term is negative 2. Plus, n is 2 minus 1 times d is 9 over 2. Next, a sub 2 is equal to, negative 2 plus, 2 minus 1 is equal to 1. Times 9 over 2 is equal to 9 over 2. So, ang second term natin is, negative 2 plus 9 over 2 is equal to 5 over 2. Ah, ito yung second term. Ang third term natin, a sub 3 is equal to, first term is negative 2 plus 3 minus 1 times 9 over 2. Next, negative 2 plus 3 minus 1 is equal to 2. Then, 2 times 9 over 2 is equal to 9. So, ang third term natin is 7. Kasi negative 2 plus 9 is equal to 7. Next, yung fourth term naman. Negative 2 plus 4 minus 1 times 9 over 2 is equal to negative 2 plus 4 minus 1 is equal to 3 times 9 over 2 is equal to 27 over 2. Negative 2 plus 27 over 2 is equal to 23 over 2. So, kunin natin yung mga reciprocal nito. Ang reciprocal ng 5 over 2 ay 2 over 5. Ang reciprocal naman ng 7 is 1 over 7. Ang reciprocal ng 23 over 2 is 2 over 23. So, ang tatlong harmonic means ay 2 over 5, 1 over 7, at 2 over 23. Another example, num number 3. Insert 3 harmonic means between 1 over 7 and 3 over 17. So, mag-insert tayo dito ng 3 harmonic means. So, meron tayong 3 then, 3 over 17. First, get the reciprocal of 1 over 7 and 3 over 17. So, ito yung first term, ito yung fifth term. So, ang reciprocal nito ay 7. Ang reciprocal naman nito ay 17 over 3. Then, find the common difference. So, a sub n is equal to a sub 1 plus the quantity of n minus 1 times d. Ang a sub n natin is a sub 5 is equal to, first term natin ay 7 plus 5 minus 1 times d. Next, a sub 5 is equal to 17 over 3 is equal to 7 plus 5 minus 1 is equal to 4. Then, d. Transpose positive 7 sa kabila, mag-change ng sign, magiging negative 7. 
So, meron tayong 4 dx. 17 over 3 minus 7 is equal to negative 4 over 3 is equal to 4 d. Then, i-divide natin to sa 4 para makuha yung common difference. So, common difference, negative 4 over 3 divided by 4 is equal to negative 1 third. So, ngayon, ito idadagdag natin di doon sa reciprocal nito. So, 7 then 17 over 3. 7 plus plus negative 1 third is equal to 20 over 3. Next, 20 over 3 plus negative 1 third is equal to 19 over 3. Next, 19 over 3 plus negative 1 third is equal to Since ang hinahanap natin ay harmonic means, get the reciprocal of the arithmetic means. So, the reciprocal of 20 over 3 is equal to 3 over 20. Reciprocal naman ng 19 over 3 is 3 over 19. Ang reciprocal ng 6 ay 1 over 6. So, ganun lamang mga nakshis. Sana marami kayong natutunan sa video na ito. Maraming salamat sa inyong panonood. Abangan ninyo ang video ko about geometric sequence. Kung meron kayong mga katanungan or clarifications, just comment down below. Once again, stay home, stay safe, stay healthy at mag-aral ng mabuti. God bless you all and goodbye!